17 year old Stephen Ortiz, uh, he did something known as Craigslist swapping, mm -hmm. where he has an object and it, rather than trying to sell it for money, he'll trade it for something that's a little more valuable. Mm -hmm. And then he'll use that new item and try to trade that for something even more valuable. And he keeps trading and trading and trading until he ends up with a Porsche. No. Okay. He, yeah, oh my God, there it is. <laughs> he started out with uh, an iPhone, a used iPhone that his friend gave him. Uh -huh. And he traded it for something a little more valuable, like I said, and uh, within time, he ended up with a Porsche. Uh, look, the reason why he fails in the story a little bit is because at one point, he ended up with a 1987 uh, Toyota 4Runner, which isn't that important. But uh, uh -huh. then at one point, he had a 1975 Ford Bronco, right? Mm -hmm. The Ford Bronco uh, is worth $15,000. He traded that in for a $9,000 Porsche. Fail. Uh -huh. But he says that it looks cooler driving a, a Porsche, so he doesn't care. Well, here's what he cares about. Turns out it costs a lot to maintain that Porsche, and now he's going to have to trade that. <laughs> Oopsie doopsie. And he, to be fair to him, though, he started out with actually an old cell phone. That wasn't even an iPhone. Okay? Mm -hmm. So, now, but that's not why I'm against Ortiz. I, I love the guy. Don't get me wrong. Okay? And, and nicely done. Mission accomplished, right? And you look badass, and... You know, you pull up in that Porsche and you got a little bit of fame behind you now, and maybe that translates to a little, you know, I'm not saying anything. Of course say, it does. I hope so. Especially hope. in high school. Are you kidding me? Yeah. <laughs> I little don't know. Little 17-year-old girls, they want to take a ride in his car. Do they? I didn't, like, I, I, wouldn't, I wouldn't know because in high school I had a beat-up Buick Skyhawk <laughs> that no one was interested in taking a ride in. And unfortunately, you're not doing too much better today. Well, <laughs> that's another story. I'm kidding. <laughs> Oh, so she's she going to do me like this. Okay. What are you talking about? I got a 2001 Pontiac Grand Am. Right. Soon that's going to be a collector's item. Anyway, <laughs> no, here's the problem. The kid spent two years, four to six hours a day doing this trading. But if you'd just gone to work for all that time, you might have earned enough money to get the Porsche anyway. Do you see what I'm saying? It's not like if he came in on an afternoon and he's drinking his lemonade and he's like, oh, I'll take a phone and I'll turn it into a toaster and I'll turn that into, you know, an oriental rug. Can we say that? And then I'll take it in and I'll turn it into a movie theater and then a mansion. I say, all right, nice work for an afternoon. You work two, hour, two years on this thing. I say, you know what? It's probably a better way you could spend your time. Here's my argument, okay? He obviously enjoyed doing this, okay? That's he, true. He's a business-minded guy. I, he liked doing this, and I'm sure it's a million times better than doing what I did when I was in high school, serving coffee to a bunch of assholes at <laughs> Coffee Bean and Tea Leaf. Okay? <laughs> so... <laughs> How would you like your coffee? Bitter? <laughs> I had a latte thrown at me. <laughs> like, <laughs> well, with this attitude, you, are you surprised? <laughs> no, I was very sweet. <laughs> I'm sure. I'm sure. Yeah, yeah. Here, here's your coffee. You like it, asshole? <laughs> Did you ever spit in anyone's coffee? No, of course not. I could okay. not do that. <laughs> Good. I think the worst thing I've ever done is, uh, I'm not gonna say. Oh, uh, post game. <laughs> <laughs> okay, post game, I will share what I did. The worst thing I've ever done. Okay. Okay. The worst thing she's ever done. Now, if that's not a reason to be a member, I don't know what is. We'll see you in the post game on that. T uh, youngturks.com slash membership. Easy, easy URL. Too easy. Youngturks.com slash membership. All right, all right, enough with that. Okay, let's move forward.